Hi, I'm Leonard, and welcome to this tutorial video on the Bebop Pro Thermal. For first time use, go to the Google Play Store and download Free Flight Thermal, the dedicated app for Bebop Pro Thermal. Screw the tablet holder onto the Parrot Sky controller. You can rotate the holder to fit your tablet's dimensions. To do this, press down and rotate it. Position your tablet on the holder and then tighten it. Connect your tablet to the Sky Controller with the micro USB cable. Switch on the Sky Controller with the white central button and then switch on the Bebop Pro drone. As the drone and the Sky Controller are paired in the factory, the connection is automatic. The central button turns fixed green when the drone is connected. Launch the Free Flight Thermal app if the app hasn't popped up automatically. Then you'll need to calibrate the drone. To do so, go to Piloting and click on the Settings icon, then Position and Calibration. Then reproduce the animations shown by the application. Still on the Position tab, check that geofencing is not limiting your mission. Generally, a max height of 50 meters and a max distance of 500 meters are good settings. To take off the drone, simply press the button located in the center of the Sky Controller 2. The Bebop Pro Thermal will rise and hover at about 1 meter above the ground, waiting for your instructions. As you can see, the Bebop Pro sensors give it a great stability. To land the drone, press on the same button as for taking off. The landing is also automatic. When pressing the landing button, make sure you're on a flat surface and there are no obstacles nearby. To make the drone go forward or backwards, move the right joystick forwards or backwards. To move sideways, move the right joystick to the left or to the right. To make your drone rise, push the left joystick upwards. To make it go back down, push the joystick downwards. To make it pivot, move your left joystick to the left or to the right. In settings, you can change the vertical and horizontal speed of the drone to make your flight much smoother. It's strongly recommended to do this when you need to fly in narrow areas. When you fly outside, make sure that the GPS icon is green before taking off. That way you can take profit from the return to home feature that allows the drone to come back to its departure point at any time by a simple press of the button. Make sure that there's no obstacle between you and the drone when using this function. To record HD video with the front camera, just press once on the record button. Press again to stop recording. The new dedicated Free Flight Thermal app provides live streaming and recording of both visual and thermal images. On the piloting interface, the flare button switches between the front HD camera and the thermal imaging view. The direction of control is given in relation to the camera used. In the thermal imaging view, the direction of control of the drone is automatically reversed. In flight, the drone adapts to the direction of control according to the chosen view. The thermal camera can be mechanically oriented in three different positions according to the mission you plan to do. You need to adjust it manually before taking off. To record thermal video, press once on the record button. Press again to stop recording. On the right tab, you can choose between three different color palettes, dynamic, hotspot, and normal. When recording thermal video, you can click on any part of the live feed to see the temperature. This will pause the live feed. Then click on the play icon underneath it to resume the live feed. Go back to the home screen of the Free Flight Thermal app and head to My Flights. You'll have a list of all of your flights. Choose the one you want to save and click on the video icon. You now have a preview of the video with regular colors. You can change the thermal color palettes that you want to apply and click on Export. Once the video is saved on your device, you can easily transfer it by email or directly to your computer. And this concludes our tutorial video on the Bebop Pro Thermal. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to check the manual or go online to the support section of the Parrot website. Have a good flight!